In this video on the Device Doctor channel, we'll show you how to reset your Epson L3251 printer and provide the reset program for free. Stay with us. If you're having trouble with your printer, you can fix it for free on your own. If you have any technical questions or aren't sure which printer to buy, just ask us for expert advice and free support. First, we turn on the printer, but it doesn't work and both lights are blinking. Then, we connect the printer to the computer using a USB cable. Now, open your Telegram app, whether on your phone or PC, it doesn't matter. Now, type Device Doctor in the Telegram search bar and find our channel easily. Also, I have added the channel link in the description of this video. Now you can see that there are many files here, including drivers and resetters. Just find the reset file for the Epson L3210, download it, and save it in a specific folder. Right-click on the desired file and select the Save As option Now, create a folder named Printer and save the file inside it. Before opening the file, you need to disable your antivirus. In Windows 10 and 11, there is a built-in antivirus that must be turned off to prevent the reset file from being corrupted. Now, open the folder and extract the file from the compressed format. Now open the folder, and as the first step, open the text file to copy the password. Now open the resetter. Be careful! If the antivirus is on, this file might get deleted. First, select your printer. The printer must be turned on and the USB cable should be connected to both the printer and the computer so that the port appears here. Now select your printer model. Now, click on the Particular Adjustment Program option. Now scroll down. Select the Waste Ink Pad Counter option and open it. Select all three options. Click on the Check button. You can see that 95% of the printer's memory is full, and now we will reset it. Select all three options again. Now click on the Initialize button. Now, turn off the printer and then turn it on again. Now, 
now the printer has been fully and perfectly reset. I hope it works the same for you. Thank you for watching. We hope this tutorial helped you reset your Epson printer. If you found it useful, please subscribe and share it with others. Your support motivates us to keep creating valuable content. Stay tuned for more from Device Doctor.